And welcome back to um, The Walking Dead Season 2. Yeah, it's a thing that we're commenting on. After some minor technical difficulties, we're uh, getting back to the swing of things. We uh, got some peroxide. We got some quote-unquote bandages. We got some stitches. And we got a needle. And True Blue's name on here is Better Fucking Work. Pretty much. Okay, so what are we going to do first? Wait, is it True Blue, blue or is it The Blue? The Blue Hedgehog. Don't, don't oh, matter. you changed like name. My, my, yeah, my old YouTube alias was True Blue, but that changed. Anyway, let's mm -hmm. pour peroxide on ourselves. Bitch, it doesn't burn that bad. Look at this weenie. Thinks peroxide burns. Let me get some alcohol for you. That'll burn. Now the fun part. Yep. Now it's time for the fun yes. part. We got some line. We got the needle. We don't have our juice box. Oh, ho, ho, don't cry. Got the juice box. <sighs> the only juice box I need is YouTube. And that's not even juice. And this is why I stay at the back end of hospital work. Yeah, personally, I've never gotten into uh, scruff. I've gotten, like... The only time I had to get stitches was back when I was like uh, I think it was four or five years old when I got my head concussion whoops yep stop being a faggot and stick the needle in So, I don't know. On a scale of shit hurts and being in pain, how much does this hurt? Well, I couldn't tell you because uh, when I had stitches, which wasn't too very long ago, um, I was numbed up pretty good. <laughs> you were drugged. Yeah, more Those or less. Pretty good <laughs> drugs. Oh, they were. You have no idea. I started giggling. <laughs> I, wouldn't <know>. <laughs> <coughs> I wouldn't know because I've never broken a bone and I've never actually ripped any actual skin. I mean, I did a good few times, but like, minorly. Like, they weren't, you know, they weren't bad to the point where I needed to go to the ER for stitches. Yeah. Like, shit, you know, was fine just as long as it had butterfly tape. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, enough. that is. Alrighty. So now we're done fixing up our arm. Oh, but we dropped our bandage. I'll just go on ahead and pick that up. Nothing bad. Oh, wait! Hi! Hi. My name's Bob. I serve burgers. No, no, come back. I just want you. I just want to give you burgers. Oh, you bitch! Ah, oh, you stupid bitch! Ah, oh, how dare you! Now I'm just gonna have to forcefully feed you the burger. No, come on! Come on! I just want to be friends! Fuck! You stupid skank! Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you that. I just wanted to feed you my burger. Please, please eat my burger. Oh, you cunt! Do you still want a burger? I'm not hearing a no. I'm done being a dumbass. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have no words. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
hell did he get in here? Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? I'm still not. Still not bitten. I never was. By more than a dog. Me out here to die. You patched yourself. You were yeah. bitten by a dog. Get that stuff? Yeah. From us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already, guys. Please. I did. I took stuff. And I'm, sorry. I'm still not oh, bitten. Yeah. What is that mark on your arm then? Oh, now you will. Yep. You hungry? Because we somehow proved ourselves. Well, that's nice. <laughs> I still think she's a wuss. <laughs> you know, your, your attitude <laughs> would be the kind that I do not want to put up with during the zombie <laughs> apocalypse. Well, lucky oh, that's for you. Nice. Still a fucking wuss. <laughs> lucky for you, early on I would trip you and you wouldn't have to deal with my attitude. <laughs> I thank you, that's very thoughtful of you, you fucking bitch. Well, I mean, I mean, past that incident and the following, you fucking bitch! <laughs> oh, I remember my cousin's famous last words. You fucking bitch! <laughs> <laughs> and that's all that will be remembered of the Blue Hedgehog 2010. <laughs> you fucking bitch. It's gonna be etched onto my gravestone. <laughs> 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 put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. <laughs> and then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. See, for the longest time, if I, wa if I were to die, I've always thought that I would like to have, well, this sucks etched onto my tombstone, but now I want you fucking bitch etched on there. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> like, it's gonna be over something stupid. Like, I'll be on my deathbed, and the last thing I'll ask is, like, can you get me a can of Pepsi? And you're like, no. It's like, you fucking bitch. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Gary, do you, do you want me to pull the plug? No. What? No. Yeah, it's okay, Gary. I'll, I'll pull the plug. You fucking <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, while you were, like, heavily drugged, I decided to surgically remove your penis. You fucking bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so you died a girl. <laughs> no, you would die a eunuch. If I, if I wanted you to die a girl, I would have to have you out long enough to have a plastic surgeon come and make you an entire vagina. <laughs> Back to the actual plot. <laughs> that got derailed very quickly. <laughs> anyway, we learn more I got about Nick here. Don't hold it again. I like that. I got, I got kind of aggro. What, was this guy, like, living in his mother's basement playing MMOs? Yeah. Speaking of, apparently, um, my friend and neighbor, Jiraiya, actually recommends uh, Diablo 3 on the consoles over to PC. Oh! A console gamer, yes. Quite nice. I wouldn't freaking know. I can't promise that you could talk me into playing that game. Yeah, I mean, I've never actually played the first or second game. So I'm a weenie. If I get if I get too scared, I'll uh, find a safe corner and I'll sit there. Like I won't even turn off the game. I'll just be sitting in this corner, like I'm too afraid to move for like half an hour before I decide to turn it off. 
the thing is that it is, I don't even think Diablo is the type of MMO that isn't supposed to be scary to begin with. So, since you're pretty much on your own... Like, from, no, what, from what I've been told, pretty much, um, you're just going deep in hell. That's pretty much it. Actually, actually, light. I lied. I've gotten a lot better. Now I just scream in horror as I run through areas shooting things. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh fuck! Uh huh. No, no, I'm not even that, it's just. What happened to your parents? If you don't. What do you think happened to my parents? I'm a little girl, I'm out here in the woods by myself, what the fuck do you think happened to my parents? Just so young. A dog bite! And to be fair, I didn't get my fucking juice box. What do you think happened? <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I know I'm irritable, but I didn't get my juice box. I didn't, I didn't get, get my nap. My, I didn't get my motherfucking juice box. So yeah, you get to learn a little bit of a backstory of Clementine here. I'm sorry to hear that. So if you haven't played the first season, well, here you go. Spoilers. I didn't yeah. play the first season, and I'm yeah. offended because spoilers. Tag them, Gary. Okay, it's gonna be tagged all over this frame on Luke's face right now. Spoiler, 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 spoiler. Apple juice. Juice box. Spoiler. Spoiler warning, we never get that juice box. Way to go. It was my fault. I just... Sometimes people die because of me. You know, to be fair, I'm in a mood for McDonald's now. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this... I was like, jeez, I'm not driving 15 miles for... Oh, wait. You're within walking distance. Yes. I am within walking dis distance. Actually... Um, I've been going to Wendy's because of their, um, four for four dollar meal. Mm-hmm. It's actually not that bad. You know, especially for four dollars. Yeah. It's like the dollar menu of Wendy's. Oh. <laughs> you get chicken nuggets, fries, a burger, and a Coke. That's damn nice. Mmm. It's very nice. If I don't feel like spending a ridiculous amount of money for food during break at Walmart, <laughs> fuck yeah, I'm going to Wendy's. Jeez. Hormonal issues much? The girl's pregnant. Hey, hey, I remember that time period, and pretty much the only issue I had was we drove past an A&W, and I almost cried. <laughs> I wish I were joking. <laughs> I sat there like, why the fuck am I about to cry? <laughs> I, really I want some ice cream. cream. I want to rip your float. <laughs> to be fair... What's root beer floats from A and W are the best the root beers floats. Things, yeah, that. Yes. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Fish traps, like bear traps, you stick in water. Pretty much. <laughs> oh, we're shooting the fish. Yeah, I suppose so. Yeah, but not a rifle. I don't think this man is used to the outdoors at all. 
<laughs> Sir, is there a McDonald's nearby? Is that a type of elk? What a baby. Hey. Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss off? Well, good to know what choices you'd pick if you were playing this game. <laughs> yes. So yeah, it's it's kind of a shame because like when I'm doing Wolf the Wolf Among Us, which we'll be playing, you know, before um, this gets put up. Um actually playing The Wolf Among Us with uh, Jimmy, you know, with live commentary and everything. Um, mm -hmm. How we're handling that playthrough is that I'm handling episode one, he's handling the next episode, so on and so forth. I see. And, like, it's going to be interesting because, like, in the first episode, I'm thinking this is how it's going to go. In the first episode, I'm a nice guy. In the second episode, I'm gonna turn into a complete dick, thanks to Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Man, I have these coupons for a free McFlurry. Even if it means people I should get that. Yes. I'm sorry, we're almost done here, and we're talking about food. <laughs> <laughs> like I feel we're not taking this commentary seriously. <laughs> like we're talking about food. We're talking about what's going to be etched into my tombstone due to you being a bitch. <laughs> well, there's a there's a lot of character development going on. There's a lot of like slice of life conversation, and we know that these people are going to die eventually. So until we get to a juicy part like this, we're like, fuck it. Pretty much. Well, I'm glad you know what your average gang of thugs would do. We don't talk about Carver. <laughs> we don't if I were you, little girl, I wouldn't talk about Carver either. <laughs> we don't talk about Carver. Get that carved into your skull. <laughs> don't there. you tell her. You told me, and let me tell you, you don't want to know. No shit, <laughs> head. Alrighty, so now we're scavenging body, dead bodies. Can yeah, I help? corpse. Got it. There you go. That's I've played enough Skyrim to be able to do this. <laughs> Let's pickpocket these assholes. <laughs> Dude, I loot everybody, and then I get into a game where I can't loot anybody, and I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I loot this? Why can't I loot this? How am I going to get stuff to sell? How am I going to get enough money for McDonald's? That's the type of vote, right? <laughs> Shut up, Pete! <laughs> Gary, they don't have McDonald's in Skyrim. Uh... And I'm... Um, no, no. <laughs> I, I was going to say, I'm pretty sure in a zombie apocalypse, there wouldn't be anybody at the McDonald's to serve you, but I take that back. I, I know how these places work. <laughs> I don't care if it's a zombie apocalypse. You're not infected. You can better have your ass at work. Pretty much. Like you'd think, you'd think people would have, you know, a smarter head on their shoulders. No, we're just busy running around, you know, hunting for food and shit like that. <coughs> when there's a fucking McDonald's sitting right there, <laughs> be worked. <laughs> it's all barricaded up. You like walk to the drive-thru speaker. Uh, hello? Uh, can I take your order? No, no, like Please someone's like, Oh my god, let me in! Would you like barbecue sauce to go with that? Oh, 
How do you people get in and out the building? Well, if we have to leave, we go out of the drive of the service windows. <laughs> it, it's an easy enough exit to monitor. And, uh, we wouldn't be here if, if we didn't have to be, but our managers say we better. <laughs> Would you like this for here or to go? <laughs> you hear, like, them being ripped apart. <laughs> to go, then, gotcha. <laughs> Tonight, we dine in hell! Oh look, it's that guy we bumped into in the beginning of the episode. Also, we found our backpack. Once again, I know you. Once again, we reach that situation where I leave somebody to suffer and die. Because they've inconvenienced me in the past. Yeah, pretty much. <clears throat> but I'm too much of a fucking softy, apparently. I would start kicking him in the head at this point until he told me. No, I'm not giving you water. You were gonna kill me, asshole. Gary, you weenie. <laughs> Would you like some barbecue sauce to go with that? <laughs> Like she just pulls out a bottle of barbecue sauce and shoves it into his mouth. I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> just lost my footing. God damn it. Lost your footing, right? Yeah. Burgers. I'm out of ammo. Come this way. Well, stop firing your guns. That's going to lure more. So now you get Take a choice silence. between Pete or Nick. Leave him to die. He's through. already gotten bit. Oh. He Would lost you like his footing. Would you sauce to go with that? Jeez. No, no, it's like you get to the, the barricaded at McDonald's and the person inside is like perfectly calm. Aren't you worried about the zombies? Sir, we're already zombies here. <laughs> it's true because like what's the main reason of going to McDonald's if it's not french fries <laughs> like, seriously son of a bitch wow that was the walking dead season 2 episode 1 glad we ended it on a good note about McDonald's <laughs> Next time on The Walking Dead, will we talk more about McDonald's? <laughs> and this guy sawing off his leg. You should not have saved him. Oh, look, there's Tina. She's gonna make us a burger. His name was Baby Daddy. <laughs> hey, little girl, I'm looking for pregnant bitch. I'm Baby Daddy. <laughs> Dun dun dun. Well, that's fun. Yeah, so like. This is cool. Yeah, like at the end of every episode, um, you are scaled uh, with the other users of what the choices they made or whatever, so. That's a neat little feature. That's cool. But, I yeah, might play yeah. just on that count. <laughs> but yeah, that was episode one of The Walking Dead season two. Um, we will certainly step 
into the second episode after the second episode of The Wolf Among Us. Ha! <laughs> Sounds good. Yes. Oh, man. Oh, look, feely music. Yep. Hey, look. I just received lasagna. No McDonald's for me! <laughs> I will never have to go another night without food. I promise. Fuck. I don't even know. Anyway, yeah, that was the first episode of The Walking Dead Season 2. What'd you think? Oh, yeah, it was interesting. So far? Yes. Uh, I think I want to play this game. <laughs> you can pick it up on PC or in PlayStation 3 I, or the Xbox 360. Uh, I think I want to play this game to make different choices than your dumbass. <laughs> Being merciful. Now is not the time for mercy, Gary. Yeah, which is why I say how. <laughs> live like the first two hours <laughs> cause like after being nice to you and then like fucking running from zombies and you trip me you fucking <laughs> bitch <laughs> you know it was only for your own good I didn't want to prolong your suffering God, you're so thoughtful you fucking bitch <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, but I really do love The Walking Dead, uh, definitely uh, presented by Telltale Games here, like, at this point in time, because, like, every few months, like, the wait was torturous, like, I get done playing, you know, the next episode I just released, only to wait, like, a few months until the new episode comes out. I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> That's why I get into these things late. Yeah. Hey. Alright, so congratulations. Yes. I'm gonna have to through. shell out some money. We got through episode one, and we will go through episode two in the next session. It's probably gonna be more than four videos, I don't know. I guess it, we'll see. It just depends. Yeah, you know, cause I don't want to make awkward cuts. Yeah. So, that's pretty much how I uh, determine the length of each episode. It's like, okay, where do I want to end this at? Understandable. So, yeah. We'll step into episode two as soon as we get through episode two of The Wolf Among Us. And uh, I hope you'll all be looking forward to more episodes from this uh game because there'll still be more just so and I'll still be here I'm, just so long as I'm still alive and not tripped <laughs> fucking bitch <laughs> anyway I'm the blue hedgehog 2010 and I'm the bitter blooded demon and uh, we will see you in episode 2 deuces